Well, hello, this is Lady Lexi here, and I'm at the Starbucks. I've just come from New Zealand. Um, I had the tourist, tourist route on the way over, which was cool, you know, um, driving past the ocean and actually seeing those islands that got mentioned in the books when I was at, uh, at uh, elementary school. <laughs> so, uh, hey, here's Goeie Overflakke. Didn't know, yeah, I read about it, but I actually saw it now, so that, that was nice. So, um, the reason I went to Zealand is that um, a friend of mine uh, said her goodbyes to her daddy today. He passed away uh, last Wednesday, and some of you may know this, but uh, seven years ago this day, my dad passed away too. So, um, coincidence has it that another friend of mine also lost her, lost her father, uh, which was uh, the Sunday before. So, two funerals in one day, at least one was being cremated. And um, yeah, the same day that, that I got to uh, say goodbye to my dad. And you know, it never really. Um, the memory doesn't fade, at least it didn't for me. I, I've come to understand him a lot better and see a lot of things. Uh, in, well, I, I basically look a lot like him, not externally, but internally I do. And, you know, it's cool. It's, I guess it's, it's wisdom coming with years or experience. I don't know what, what it is, but, you know, I could pass that on. To, to my friend and her brother. Um, I, I also said I don't know what it's going to be like for them, but you know, it's just being able to support them, which felt really good. So um, I stood next to her when she was reciting her poem about even daddies meet girls holding their hand. Um, and that's what I did too when my father passed away. So, um, what have you done lately to support someone else who needs it and what did it mean to you? Let me know. Okay, later.